It started off so nicely, but it didn't last. Whose idea was it for this specific program? I've read the legislation. The legislation doesn't say anything about setting up a cockamamie idea in Cuba with Twitter accounts and all on something that the Cubans would be so easy to, to discover. Whose idea was this specific program to go to Cuba? Who? It's a simple question. Uh, sir, the program was in place before I arrived. Leahy is incensed that USAID was involved in setting up a social media network in Cuba as part of the U.S.'s efforts to destabilize the government there. USAID insists it's done nothing wrong and its actions weren't covert. Senator Leahy, who chairs the Senate subcommittee overseeing USAID, says he'd never heard of such a program and that it was a, quote, stupid idea to begin with. They don't always work, and I'll be the first to admit that, but, but this one, often they this do. One had this one from the get-go had no possibility of working. That's my problem. Leahy was also angry about the effect the story will have on a USAID contractor currently serving a 15-year sentence for illegally attempting to set up an Internet service in Cuba. Alan Gross's lawyer says his client has begun a hunger strike and that it was, quote, shocking that USAID had imperiled his safety even further by running a covert operation in Cuba after his arrest. But longtime observers of USAID say this is what the organization does, alongside the humanitarian activities one might expect. AID is one of the two leading US government agencies which is involved with uh, overthrowing foreign governments in the name of instituting democracy. Blum says the agency has long held close ties with the intelligence community. John Gulligan, the former head of AID, he said at one point, that the, the, the AID was infiltrated by the CIA from top to bottom. At the hearing, Leahy relayed the concerns of U.S. AID employees who said their lives are put in danger through operations like that revealed last week. But Shah was unrepentant for what he suggested was a core function of U.S. AID. Shihabritansi, Al Jazeera, Washington.